hey y'all welcome or welcome back y'all know the first thing i have to do before i even step into the shower is wrap up my hair because we don't want no issues we don't want it to be frizzy so i'm putting on my bonnet and my scarf and then getting into the shower <laughs> The first thing I do is I exfoliate. So I use sea salt twice a week for my bikini area. For the rest of my body, I use the Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub and I have the vitamin C version. I use it on my arms, my legs, basically the rest of my body. And you can see that I use it a lot because it's almost gone. The reason I use this before I wash my body is because it has coconut oil in it and coconut oil can actually clog your pores and your skin so i will use it before i wash and then when i actually wash my body it'll still be soft my skin will still be soft but it won't be clogged my pores won't be clogged you only want to use sugar scrubs on parts of your body like your arms your chest and your legs anything that is not a sensitive area because you do not want sugar anywhere down there it will mess up your ph balance so that is why i use salt Next, I'm washing and I'm using my Dr. Teal's Eucalyptus Body Wash, absolutely my favorite. And I'm using my exfoliating towel. And I use that so that I can easily wash my back and I can exfoliate, lightly exfoliate my skin at the same time of washing it. The reason why I love the Dr. Teal's Eucalyptus Body Wash so much is because it makes me feel like my sinuses are being cleared. Even if it doesn't actually do that for me, I feel like it helps because I have sinus issues and it just smells so fresh. Next, I'm gonna be shaving, and I have this Pure Venus shaving cream, but I don't use it because it's kind of drying. So what I will use is my Aussie Miracle Moist Conditioner. Yes, you heard it, it's conditioner. And it is very moisturizing for my skin, so. I also use a Flamingo razor, and it has a weighted handle, so it's easier to navigate and maneuver while shaving and it's good quality. So if you see when I'm shaving, you can see that the razor, it kind of glides with my skin. The way that the razor is designed, is designed to literally go along with your skin. So it's really flexible. And next I'm going to be shaping my legs as well and I'm still using the conditioner.
of the shower, you wanna pat your skin dry and not just rub it. And now we are on to products I use outside of the shower. We are starting out with my Thayer's Witch Hazel. I have the rose petal version and I spray this on my underarms and I spray it on my face as well just to use as a toner. And then I let that dry before I add my deodorant. For deodorant, I am using Kapari, the regular coconut oil scent. It smells really good. It's aluminum free and it does not cause any burn. I know my underarms are still dark, but it is not from this deodorant. I, I don't know what it is, but I know it's not from the deodorant because I've been using it and my underarms were lighter. So yeah, but I really enjoy this deodorant and I've been using it for probably about a year now I'm not sure exactly how long but a long time this is an addition from my last one I use this bikini bump blaster and they're like little circular pads with the the witch hazel and everything on it and I use this on my bikini area because I get waxed and whenever you wax or shave it's easy to get ingrown hairs I am still using my sweet almond oil. At first I was just using it for my face, but it's light and it's very effective at moisturizing. So now I pretty much use it all over my body. I also used it on my bikini area because it wasn't too heavy for it. But like I said, now I use it pretty much all over my body now. Since it is getting colder, I'm also going to be using my blueberry body butter. I will leave the link for it in the description box. Everything will be in the description box, but this is just like an added thing for more moisture since it is getting colder and I want to really trap the moisture into my skin. So I just add this and also it smells amazing. That is it for my shower routine as you can see I got a little bit of frizz but it's all good I am now fresh and clean and that is my fall 2021 shower routine thank y'all so much for watching as always and I will see y'all in the next video